the Shumai, everybody. Um, uh, basically, I'm going to um, read a poem uh, which I wrote, which was very difficult to write. Um, it's called Belfast <laughs> uh, because our writing group went on an open bus top tour around Belfast. It was my first time that I went on one. <laughs> I probably thought I would have never have went on one, but I did, and it was very inspirational. Uh, and of course, you know, it's it's hard to get away from the the troubles, but I just felt they overdid that thing too much uh, and it's hard to bring out Belfast's character in a way and about uh, the people and 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 what it's been like over the years um, and Harlan Wolf itself was uh, the biggest shipyard in the world and sometimes it is hard to fathom that when you think about it you know especially when you look at you know the industry now around the world, uh, but it, it was quite a place. Uh, I picked up this book actually um, uh, from yeah, I think o Oxfam. It was you know, Ox I think it was the one in town. Uh, it's by Joe Nolan, and it's called Down by the uh, Slipway: uh, Poems of the Shipyard. Um, it's very good. It was a wee gem, like though it did it did cost me seven <laughs> seven quid, <laughs> but it's worth it, um, and hopefully the shipyard will be saved. Um, but um, this is a class uh, thing. Basically, it's uh, that's the mel make, which is a Belfast make of tools, and it was a tools from Shorts. Uh, uh, my granddad uh, got this. I'm sure it's worth a little bit, not much, uh, but it's it's superb. Um, and also, I even have a uh, a shorts um, a pencil, which is Shorts Brothers and Harland Limited. <laughs> the original, let me tell you, <laughs> it's, it's not a new one or anything. <laughs> But anyway, I'm going to read you this piece now. It's called Belfast. A leading industry of shipbuilding. It's hard to fathom now when you look at the rest of the world. It's now a shh. Has she said rest, my quiet man? It is his foreign lover that is helping him. As if the sandbar, the reclaimed land in terracotta, burnt sienna, yellow ochre. The sandstone's enchantment of St. Anne's, watching Writer's Square. Far set spews forth a river of poets, the lagging of the peaceful laid string from the sky's eye, reminisce with her, the Linopolis. O oh, fair maiden, to carry him on liquid jewels. This is the religious garden, in the midst the passion flower to proclaim, a flower that bears witness. In the pictorial synopsis, to tell a story of the holy lands in four layers. To make authentic an echo of a pilgrimage, in peasantry brown a hard-working frown. Belfast Child, the song by Simple Minds. The workers in the federal system, so easily forgotten, begotten in this here town. Cram the bridge in black-grey sackcloth, the dark of the starlings nestle a compact flight. Teal tears from a smog-filled shroud to cover. Open wide the lagging, as if being sick into the ocean. But she now gives clean water from the land's body, her internal pipes and tubes, the twisting of the river's intestine to be rediscovered in a place. But time? I look back in old black and white photographs captured by Frankie Quinn. 
of days gone past to go over grey areas, yet then it was in full clarity in the colour of now. So painterly seen in red bricks and rusting bright orange railing bars, vivid green with yellow flowers, such close-up shapes and abstraction to crop to contain. She has been barren from the galloping pale horse, as if the apocalyptic cityscape with many homes boarded up. But back then it was still in colour. Every passing of a bag so suspiciously left on the street, fear clung the grey air. Overcast indeed, it always rains here, perhaps to try and put out a blaze from fury. A tourist delight, but money is no pride of the alienation in the, in the yellow bite. Industrial things are not usually bright yellow. Frame shots of a picture frame along the grace of the skyline. The spine run down the front of the figure. No backbone, but on the front of a metal anthropic framework propped upon the world as a lamp post at Queen's Bridge. Posted as an entry, a guard to enter the city from the east side, through the portal's hoop, and to the past the continuous loop, alien nonic in the landscape, angelic applied. These slight hues to franchise in tones and depths of the letter H, Differentiate Harland and Wolf. Home and peace is no referendum, as if yes and no is easy to say. Let's not forget the lovers from either end of Tate's Avenue. To be pirates of the land in territory divide, a tragic Romeo and Juliet, a reciprocal allegiance. But I like to look upon Belfast as bells of fast, steadfast, with my legs and feet running fast, to always return to Belfast's chime, where we hope the storm has passed. Uh, thanks very much. Uh, uh, peace to Belfast, and God bless her people. Amen.